How to Backup Windows System with Cloud Backup Pro First of all, create a backup set. Click the Add button to create a new backup set for Windows System Backup. Select the Windows System Backup Set Type. Input your preferred name for this backup set. Specify the location where you want to store the system backup. OK, next. Select the volume that you need to backup. Now, we need to create schedules for automatic backup. A weekly schedule is created by default. Click on it to modify the details. Let's change its name. Select the days of week you need to run the backup. And specify the start time. Select this option to run retention policy after backup, for cleaning up outdated backup data. OK, next. If one schedule is not enough, you can add as many schedule as needed. No upper limit. Let's add a monthly schedule. You can choose a specific day of month to run the backup. Or, you can select which week, and the day of that week, for backup. For example, Monday of the first week. Select the start time for backup. Again, select this option to run retention policy after backup, for cleaning up outdated backup data. OK, next. We have created two schedules. Let's move on. Now, we need to set up the destination for backup. Let's set up a local destination. Select the path for this local destination. You can test if this destination is ready for use. OK, next. For this demo, we just select one destination. You can add as many destinations as needed here. If you have multiple backup destinations, you can also choose sequential or concurrent backup to these destinations. OK, next. This part is for setting up data encryption. For the default encryption type, Cloud Backup will generate a 256-bit AES truly randomized encrypting key for you, so that no easily hackable key, such as ABC123, will be used for encrypting your critical data. You can always modify the default setting by choosing the custom option, so that you can choose your preferred encryption algorithm, method, key length and encrypting key. As now, we only need to back up locally, we can simply turn off the encryption. OK, next. Enter your domain password for allowing Cloud Backer to access your network. Our Windows System Backup Set is created. Scheduled backups will be run automatically according to your defined schedules. Now, we can fire a backup manually by clicking this button. Let's see what advanced options we have. Let's run a full backup by selecting full here. OK, 
Start the backup now. When backup is finished, you can click this icon to read the detailed backup log. Close this backup window to go back to the software main page. You can also read the backup related report here. Click the roll to read the details for that item. In this usage report page, you can have a glance for the storage usage of the selected destination and backup set. Let's see the storage usage of our Windows system backup set. Thanks for watching. Visit our YouTube channel for more videos of Cloud Backup.